Now, the report on the missing people provided by government in parliament yesterday, uh, read by the Minister of State for Internal Affairs, General David Mohozi, has been described by many opposition members of parliament as half-baked. Uh, the minister told parliament yesterday that the next of kin of the missing people were not cooperative because they had been stopped by NUP leaders from speaking to the authorities. The next of kin of the reported missing persons, first of all, didn't cooperate with the police investigators until the police team had to hold out as members of an NGO in order to interview these people. For example, Navakosa Florence, the next of kin of Wangoro Dennis, Alaya Safik, declined to meet the investigators, stating that she had not got instructions from NUP to meet any person. Uh, General David Mohozi also claimed that most of the missing people were never reported to police, making it impossible for government to investigate their cases. Now, the leader of opposition in parliament, Horrible Matas Mbuga Samba, on X said now that government has shown unwillingness to make full disclosure, they are retreating as the opposition caucus from plenary. They will return on Tuesday next week with a rejoinder and also inform the public on their next course of action. Hashtag accountability and service. But I thought it after consulting with my team that we are better off threading it by responding to it with a rejoinder next week. So guys, what do you make of this report on the missing people? Are you satisfied or not yet? The <laughs> As usual, the comment section is uh, very open for you. My name is uh, Melads Milo, aka Fula. This is uh, the Buzz UG. Subscribe and also tap on the bell for all the notifications. Uh, don't forget to follow me on TikTok. I'm using the same names that side Melads Milo, aka Fula. It is a uh, bye for now. Thank you. Thank <laughs> you.